So this is self-oxidizing cast material. You mind coming out of camera? The longer that it is in the air, the harder it's going to get. Ah, that's what it is. Yeah. So this is splinting material, not casting material. Casting material is basically the same thing, but it's a little bit more durable. Uh, so that stuff, you can have one for months. What's up? Okay. So here we go. I'm going to put your arm right here. Go ahead and put your arm down. What's wrong? What's wrong? Uh, we got a psych patient outside. He's already off of the drain. Thank you guys for what you do. Thank you for thanking us, because you'll be amazed at the number of people that cuss us out. I've seen him in my very face. I mean, hands, eyes. I'm, so, I'm sorry, I didn't go stupid. No, you, you're good, man. You're good. <laughs> I just, bro, I understand. Like, uh, yeah, this guy, this guy's been no more than hospitable. The moment I, he saw me walk up that ramp, he greeted me. So this is called an ulnar gutter splint. And this is basically designed to hold your arm in place as much as possible so that you don't hurt yourself any further. Okay. The provider is going to explain to you exactly what's going on with your arm so that you have a full understanding. Okay. But I'm going to wrap this up and then I'm going to make it look all nice and pretty in just a second. I'm going to, I'm going to fold that down so that you have this nice, pretty looking splint. Sorry if it hurts a little bit. Is Unfortunately, I do have to put a little bit of pressure on it. Okay? Uh, yeah, you're the professional. You know what you're doing. Not too tight? Feels good? Feels good. Feels secure. So with this... So that it so that it feels proper, I'm gonna fold that down. See how that is? Yes. I'm gonna take another rack. And then this way it doesn't irritate. So while you have this on, this isn't gonna irritate your arm and make it feel itchy. Because like here, I'll, I'll show you a second. I feel a sensation when you put pressure right there. Yeah, which is a good thing because you should feel some you, you want to feel sensation, sir. The last thing you want to feel is nothing, because if you feel nothing... Nothing's happening. Yeah, you're not getting proper blood flow, you're not getting something. Oh, okay. Do me a favor, wiggle your fingers for me. Or can you? There you go, okay. So right, right after that happened, I was trying to grab my bike and my bag in my hand, I was like, whoa! <laughs> and it wasn't, it wasn't even like... So, reacting. the reason I do that is, here. Just fill that with your fingers. Feel how coarse that is? That's coarse. what's on the back coarse. That's what's on the back end of that. I don't want that rubbing against your skin however long you're gonna have this on. Okay. So, so I'm already I'm already I'm guessing something's broken already. Um, you're gonna have to wait for the provider to tell you. I can't tell you that. All right. Like, the way that it works is I legally cannot tell you anything that the doctor needs to tell you. It's a surprise. <laughs> Yeah. And I was just I was just starting to play guitar again. Okay, do me a favor, take your arm across your chest. Right there. I pledge allegiance. To the flag of the United States of America and to the Republic for which it stands, one nation under God. You know it's funny? They added the under God in the 1970s. And then they took it out? No, it's still there. It was, they added it in the 1970s. Didn't used to be there. Okay, right back across your chest. How's that feel? Feels like it's healing now. Good. Yes. So the provider will come and speak with you in just a minute and then they're going to get you out of here. Thank you, sir. You're welcome. That's how you do it.